Part 1. Listen to a short talk about the Pomodoro Technique. The Pomodoro Technique is a method that can help you become more focused and be productive. An Italian man developed this technique, and now, many people all over the globe use it. He used a kitchen timer that was in the shape of a tomato. Since tomato, in Italian, is called pomodoro, this method is also named the pomodoro technique. The technique is easy to follow. You start by choosing a task you want to accomplish. It could be studying, working on a project, or even doing household chores. Then, you set a timer for 25 minutes, which is called a Pomodoro. During this time, you work on your task without any distractions. When the timer goes off, you take a short break for about 5 minutes. You can rest, get a drink of water, or do something enjoyable to relax your mind. After the break, you set the timer for another 25 minutes and continue working on your task. Each 25-minute work session is one Pomodoro. After completing four Pomodoros, you take a longer break, usually around 15 to 30 minutes. This break allows you to recharge and think about your progress. You can use this time to have a snack go for a short walk, or do something you enjoy. The Pomodoro technique is based on the idea that focused work for a short period can boost productivity. By breaking your work into short intervals, you do not get tired and can stay focused on your task. Try the Pomodoro technique and see how you can be more productive in daily tasks. Part 2. Let's learn the meanings of the seven new words. Productive. When you use less time or energy to do the same thing, you are more productive. Having a daily plan helps you be more productive. Task. A piece of work that you have to do. I have a long list of tasks to do today. Accomplish. To do something successfully. The team worked together to accomplish the project. Household chores. Tasks such as cleaning the home that are usually boring and need to be done regularly. I usually do my household chores on the weekends when I have more free time. Distraction. Something that stops your focus. My phone is a big distraction when I'm trying to study. Go off. When an alarm goes off, it makes a noise. The alarm goes off every morning at 7 a.m. Interval. A period of time between two events. The interval between each train arrival is about 10 minutes. Part 3. Let's practice new words. When the alarm goes off, I jump out of bed. Sometimes, I help my mother with household chores, such as making lunch and dinner. Starting early in the morning makes my day more productive.
When I am studying, the noise of cars is a big distraction for me. We should have some intervals for relaxation during a long working day. I want to accomplish my school project by Friday. I have an important task to complete today. Part 4. Let's review today's lesson. Once the timer goes off, you take a short break for about 5 minutes. After the break, you set the timer for another 25 minutes and continue working on your task. Each 25-minute work session is one Pomodoro. After completing four Pomodoros, you take a longer break. By breaking your work into short intervals, you do not get tired and can stay focused on your task. Now you have learned seven new words. If you'd like to practice more, please make some sentences with these new words in the comments section of this video. Thanks for watching. If you liked our channel, please subscribe.